James Sabalski for EA Sports as the playoffs continue here with game number two. Opening face-off is just seconds away. This is what you play for. Moments like this, you can feel the energy in this building. And the puck stopper jumps on top of it to get a stoppage in play. Lots of hockey left to be played in this period. We've still got zeros on the board. Abbott Donato's won it in their own end. And now he moves it quickly to hit Estroza. Wilkes-Barre Scranton's on the attack. Good defensive stop with the poke check. Gives them nothing in front. The lane was plugged up and that shot's blocked. Nice save from point blank range. They just keep coming in waves here in the offensive end. Sidney B, and that's stopped. No quarter given here as they battle for the loose puck along the boards. From point blank range, denies it in front. The goaltender's at the last line of defense for a reason, and this time, he bails his team out. The Penguins win the draw. Providence has got the puck along the boards. Stopped by the goaltender getting a piece of that one. That's a fantastic save by the goaltender, but this team has to do a better job of protecting the middle of the ice. Those high danger scoring chances eventually go in. And they win the draw. Now let's see what they can do with it. We got a whistle as the puck goes out of play. And they win the offensive zone face-off. Now let's see if they can capitalize. Fadoon's moving the puck through his own zone. The Bruins gain possession along the wall. Oh, a little crash, bang, boom in the corner. Listen to this place. Tries to the crease. Makes a save. Gets a piece of it with the glove. Anson's plays it against the board. Stick. Moves it quickly over to Arsenal. Odd man rush to his teammate. There he is, he goes. Oh, oh my goodness, it's Stina. What a save. It was all but in James, and that athleticism and the will to get to that puck, that was on display. We haven't even hit the midway mark of the period. Still looking for our first goal. Poulin's won the faceoff, and now let's see what they can do. And a solid save on the play there. A player should never be left alone in the slot, but man, is the goaltender to task here. Gets out in front of it and makes the save. See if we can pick up some momentum again here as a faceoff is ready to go. The Bruins win it in the defensive zone. Slides the puck over. Oh, smart heads that play to poke that one away. Here we go, pucks in deep. Big hit, and that frees up possession. Slides it on over to Harrison. The Bruins played along the wing. Here's a shot. How did he stop that one? A timely save is everything to your team, and this goaltender, he bails his team out. Wilkes-Barre Scranton's won the draw. Moves the puck over to Johnstone. Sends it in front. Picked oh! off in front. The Bruins move the puck in the defensive zone. Hands it over on the attack. Oh, a clutch save. Oh, and he tracks it perfectly in the offensive end. And another save. This is a really nice 
save, James. I mean, the shooter's in the middle of the ice. He's in the slot area. He's got to get to the top of the three, square to the puck to be able to make that save. Great job. coming up here. Well, you know that you want to gain possession and you want to keep the pressure on because the goaltender is the only one who can't change and he is the most fatigued guy on the ice. So you want to find ways to get some net front presence, get shots through the net because, man, he needs a rest. Off a stick and they can't connect. Toporowski's swooping in on the attack. zone. Slides it over with pace to McLaughlin. Great heads up play with the stick by Fadoon. Picking up some steam at center ice. The Penguins carry it along the wall. Quick pass to Smith. Reaches out and uses the stick. There's a firm collision. Great point check on the reach. The pass will go! period. Still no score in this one. Locks him up on the draw as they take possession. I don't think anybody was hanging on to the puck after that hit. He might have a step here. All alone! Oh, it's a the play! Uh, this is a great play by the tender to anticipate and get across to make that save. Big time saving goal as he gets all of it with the stick. And the centers glide towards the dot here as we got a face-off set to go. Providence has got the puck inside the offensive zone. The Penguins will play it in their own end. Cuts to the paint. The Bruins get a hold of the puck in their own end. Through the neutral zone and into the offensive end. Taken by Smith. Here they come. Down the left side on the attack. Fires it on there. Scores! And that's his first goal of the postseason ever. And he'll take it. It's much needed too, James. You get to the playoffs, you want to make sure that your teammates have trust in you and you have trust in yourself because you want to be an impact player. That's a nice start. Wilkes-Barre Scranton's opportunistic game finally pays off as they have the game's first goal here in the back half of the frame. Well, now it's about continuing to push, right? One goal simply isn't enough. You're at the back half of the first, which means there's over 40 minutes left to play in this game. they got to continue to execute if they want to wind up with a W at the end of this one. Providence has got control of it now from their own end. From the top of the offensive zone here. And the traffic jam in front blocks the shot. Puck moved over to Mitchell. Poked away in the defensive end. Oh, he has a beat, but it goes off the inside post. Play whistle dead. Penalty coming up. Well, when you're looking for a goal, being shorthanded is not ideal. You're also killing valuable time where you can be pressing when you're PK. And a man 
advantage unit comes out to go to work. Well, first power play of the game, James. You want to start with possession and look to get shots to the net. It is the tone setter. There's a shot tipped in front. And he makes the save on that play. The Bruins will kill off a few extra seconds now. Locks him. Looking to set up offensively. The Bruins get a hold of the puck. And they get that puck down the ice. Takes the feed. Broken up with a stick. Oh, great glove save. Off the goaltender and in. That's a goal. Well, the position is tough enough. And then you have these goals that wind up in the back of the net. He deposited it himself. And that's a real tough one to handle. This next shift, this next save, it's huge. Providence is down, but not out. They've had chances. They just haven't capitalized. Off the draw, and he ties up his opponent. The Bruins cross the blue line and are on the attack. And that's broken up with a stick in front. And the play continues. Shafts the puck away. Delayed penalty looming. They've got some momentum here. Big save in front. Now a quick pass to Smith. Whistle blows, stopping the play. I understand when you're racing for the puck to stand in the way of your opponent to slow them down, but if you hang out there too long, you're going to get the interference call. to bring the offense for his team. Saboral's a steady defender who's known to join the rush. Now, as I send it back upstairs, I'll be watching out for one of these players to give their team a chance to win tonight. And they clear that puck. Retrieves the puck, trying to kickstart this power play. Up along the wing. Slides it back to the blue line. And he was ready for that one. for a whistle. McLaughlin's ready for the draw as they continue to be shorthanded here. Inside the final minute of the first here. Trying to come up with a huge defensive play to get this puck out of his own end. Tried to get 2 Q with it and loses possession. Quintus Jones has got a lot of flash to his game, in particular with his hands and the ability to manipulate his opponent, but he gets caught on that one and the puck dies on his stick. Here's a Howard Scott in there. 20 minutes in the books. Let's grab a breather and we'll come back with period number two in months. Fun environment for kids visiting long-term care patients. If you'd like to learn more or to go, please visit our team website.
We are about ready to get underway here for the second period. Arsenal's penalty is almost expired. And play has resumed here in period number two. Well, we've seen a pretty good sample size already played thus far. Cheryl, your assessment? Helberg's been fantastic in the game so far, James. I mean, he's the only reason his team is still in it. We're still in the early stages of this period. Wilkes-Barre Scranton's got a 2-0 lead. Swoops in off the wing to grab the puck after the centerman tied him up. Wilkes-Barre Scranton's got possession here in the offensive zone. The Bruins have had more scoring chances, more shots, but they still trail early in period number two. Wilkes-Barre Scranton's won the draw. The Penguins will play it from the defensive zone. Down the right wing and into the offensive zone. Tries to feed it over to Vegda. Denies that opportunity. Well, this is an incredible save, James. It's anticipation as well. Recognize that the shooter is in the low slot, getting in front of it and making the save. Made the save on the play. Goaltender hangs on for the whistle. Centers glide into the dots. We're ready to get things back going again. The Bruins will go to work here in the offensive zone. Quick feed to Megba. Good heads up play in the defensive zone. The Penguins take it along the wall. Huge play in his own end to come up with the puck. Angles it over to Tomorowski. The Bruins looking against the half wall. Hammers the shot. Standing tall with the save. Providence has got the puck along the wall. They're looking to make something happen through the neutral zone now. Wilkes-Barre Scranton's got the puck in their own end. The Bruins get a hold of it. Shot! That's blocked by Helberg. There's the whistle as the goalie hangs on. Lots of time left in this period. Wilkes-Barre Scranton's got some breathing room as they lead it 2-0. Anson's has it in their own end. And loses possession after a solid hit. Just a little too much contact and couldn't hang on to the puck. Anson's carries the puck in his own zone. And it's poked away in the neutral zone. Nice heads-up play there. Slides it quickly to McLaughlin. Carries it across the line. Broken up by Anson's. Moves it to Smith. Here they come through center and into the offensive end. Puck scooped up by Joshua. Slides it out in front. Couldn't complete the pass. Slides the puck ahead to Zabor. Moves it quickly over to Arsenal. And he comes up big with a stick shake. Score! And that's his first career playoff goal, and he'll take it. Uh, he will, James, because the playoffs is just a different beast. It's not regular season anymore. You want to be an impact player. You want to make a difference, and he does tonight. The Bruins have new life here in period number two after that strike here. They strike and they're able to convert finally, James, as they've had a ton of opportunities and they're shooting from everywhere. Handles it again. The Bruins play it along the boards. Here's a short pass to Harrison. And he gets in front of that. Sends a pass over. And now it's turned away. We'll get a face-off after the puck stays covered up. Inching closer to the midway mark of this period. The Bruins make their way back into the face-off circle, still in search of another goal. Severukov's got the puck in his own zone. Shot! And that's blocked. Slides it up ahead from the right wing. Sends it in deep. Wilkes-Barre Scranton's gained possession along the boards. Through the neutral zone now, picking up steam. Quick pass to Harrison. Passes ahead to the right side. Scores! And look at that, the rookie gets in on the playoff scoring. Now talk about embracing the nervous energy. Now he can take a breath, feel good about himself, and let the creativity flow. A great place.
placement, but he had to get the one-timer off quickly, James, because he didn't have much time and space in that net front area. You know that they're going to close quickly on you when you find that that puck comes across. Moments away from the face-off. Let's get back to the action. The Bruins get a hold of the puck off the draw. Scranton's got a hold of it against the wall. Hilbert's taking the puck now here inside his own territory. They take possession as he locks him up on the faceoff. Knocks the puck loose. Goaltender covers it up. We get a whistle to slow things down. Getting closer to the halfway point of this frame. It's all tied up. The Bruins win the draw. And the official the score on the delay penalty to make it count. No, well, they do make it count, James. Now it will negate their power play opportunity. But hey, when you capitalize, you don't get the power play. Just a fabulous goal, James, with a lot of elements woven into it. I mean, he's stumbling, so he almost falls, but he's able to get a shot off just in time. He's able to hold himself up and get that shot off. His hands away from his body, not in the greatest position, but he manages to find the back of the net. Providence's push here in the second is paying off as they now bleed by one. Well, you can certainly see the energy shift in the bench and the coaching staff talking to the team about continuing to push, keep the pedal to the metal here. While you have your opponent down, you got to attack. From off the wall and onto a stick. Puts it in deep. Wilkesbury Scranton's got the puck. Up along the wall on the right side and into the attacking area. Denied by the puck stopper. And the puck stopper hangs on to get a breather here for the team. The Bruins are checking all the boxes tonight. More shots, more goals, and they lead in the second. Back underway as he wins the draw inside the offensive zone. No quarter given here as they battle for the loose puck along the boards. Can't make the play and the puck leaves the zone. Puck knocked loose in the neutral zone. Now he takes it over the line. Picked up along the boards by Fadoon. And that's some great pressure in the offensive end by Toporowski. From the left side, takes it at center. Puck picked up by Walsh. Providence has got it in their own zone. Quick feed to Toborowski. Through the open ice, they're picking up steam. Tries to dangle and the puck skips away. Toborowski's trying to get a little too fancy with the puck there, and as a result, he loses it. Denied that one. That's another consecutive save. What a sequence. I mean, he has been outstanding making consecutive saves. I mean, his defense, they got to start playing. Into the offensive end now. Picked off by Hall. Moves it to the offensive zone. Shot! Teed up and turned away on his part. Past the halfway mark of this period, Providence has got a 3-2 lead at this point. Ensigns wins the draw on their own end. Wilkesbury Scranton's looking to break out. Joshua's got the puck. And it's a quick pass to Sahorna. The Bruins have it behind the net. Through the neutral zone, moving the puck along the side. On the attack along the boards. Quick shot! And that caroms off a body in the lane. Ever quick on his feet, anticipating the play. Excellent reflexes. He's saving his team right now. Oh, he gets his glove on that and just enough to keep it out. Wilkesbury Scranton's got a hold of the puck now. Big time stop. 
This is a fantastic save, James. He's all over it. What I mean by that is he knows exactly where it is and where it's moving. A reason why he can get there to it and make the save. Getting into the later stages of this period, Providence is hanging on to this 3-2 lead. The Penguins will start off on the attack after winning the draw. Oh, a trapper saved by DiPietro. Well, this save looks easier than it actually is. I mean, when you have a shooter right in the slot and you know that you've got to find a way to get your glove on it, you've got to be fast, you've got to be quick and show those reflexes, he does that and makes the save. Center's jammed up and the winger grabs the puck. Right up the gut into the attacking zone. Sends the pass over. from point blank range. I mean, he's in fabulous position, square to the shooter in the slot, and he makes the glove hand save. Providence has been putting lots of pucks on net all night long, and they lead it here late in the second. The Penguins win the faceoff. Moves it to Renew. And he's ridden off the puck. Here's a block! Too many bodies in the way. And the puck's cleared away. And that's out of reach and out of the offensive zone. Shot. Here's a shot. Oh, club save and a beauty. Di Pietro's been outstanding tonight, James. I mean, he's made the saves he's had to and really given his team an opportunity to win. You can't ask for more than that. And we're moments away from getting back underway here with the puck drop. And they win the draw here in their own end. Picks up the puck in his own end. The Bruins are on the attack. Lugs the puck into the offensive zone corner. Hilbert's got the puck and he's going to hang on. In the final moments of this period, the Bruins have a little breathing room here, but not much as they lead it 3-2. Providence won the draw here in the defensive zone. They gain the offensive zone from the middle. Fires it! Comes up with a monster save in front. We know the goaltender was set to this position, square to the shooter, to be able to make that glove save. Wilkes-Barre Scranton's won the draw, and they'll go to work. Here's a shot. Still has possession. Providence has got a hold of the puck. Fires it into the offensive zone. A spirited battle along the boards for the puck. Picked up along the wall by Semarukov. Down the left wing and into the offensive zone. Scores! And the kid comes up clutch here in the postseason. Oh, he does it. James gets his first playoff goal. I mean, it's incredible the confidence that this should give him. I mean, the pressure and the stakes are high, and he delivers. Oh, that's a really tough break for the tender, James. I mean, listen, when structure breaks down and there's all kinds of stuff going on in front of you, you can't track, you can't get your eyes on the puck, and it winds up in the back of your net. Wilkes-Barre Scranton's equalizer comes on a lot of hard work here in period number two. The coach will be happy with this performance, the pushback, the fight to claw their way back in late in the second, and this will set them up nicely for the third. Well, there's the horn, and that means two periods down, and there's still a critical third to play. Looking forward to this one. Third period action is coming up. Two down, one to go. Third period, they're ready to drop the puck. It has been a fantastic matchup here, back and forth at both ends of the ice. Let's see what happens in the third. Oh, how did he get a glove on that? What a stop by Di Pietro. Still plenty of time left in this frame. The next goal could be a big one as we are tied. The Penguins win it. Great defensive effort with the stick. Long jam in front, that's broken up. Here's a blast. Providence is moving it up the ice. Puck dumped in. Wilkes-Barre Scranton's got possession of the puck. Tosses it on to Abandonado. With possession along the wall. And he shuts the door on that. Hard 
It frees up the puck. Taken along the wall by Avicinato. And that one's gone! And we get a whistle as the goaltender decides to hang on to this one. Looks like lineups are set and they're ready to get things back underway. Competence won the draw and they're on the attack. And it gets nowhere near the net blocked on the play. Into the offensive zone down the right wing. Slides the puck across. Wilkes-Barre Scranton's gained the line and into the zone. Oh, and it stays out. He got a piece of that one. Does a great job with some great pushes to get to the top of his crease and make the save from a high danger area. And he gives it over to Samarukov. Wilkes-Barre Scranton's got the puck along the wall. Poked away in the offensive zone by Kopanen. Moves it to the middle. Moves it quickly over to Toborowski. Wilkes-Barre Scranton's looking to break out of their own end. Oh, look at the pass. Oh, he got a piece of it to keep it out. Shot right around. When the puck's in the low slot, the goaltender gets right out next to the shooter and makes the save. Takes the feed. Moves it around along the half wall. Here's a chance! Monster blocker stopped by DiPietro. Here's a short pass to Smith. Great heads up, play to poke it away in the offensive end. Loses possession after he takes a little hit. Quick pass to Arsenal. And he maintains possession of the puck here. Looks like we got a delayed tripping penalty coming up here. Well, look at this, Cheryl. Here we go. The parade is officially underway. It certainly is. And everyone in the building, you can hear the crowd just jeering with their frustration, including everyone on the bench, completely deflated right now. A non-stop procession to the penalty box for the home team. The Penguins once again send out their power play unit. Well, they've already scored tonight on the PP, James, and looking to really thread the needle again on this one. Their movement, their adjustments have been excellent thus far. Let's it go! Oh, it perfectly. What a save! The Penguins have it in the offensive end. Hammers a shot! And he gets in front of the slot shot to make the save! Special teams so important. Can they capitalize on this power play here with a face-off? Evan Donato's won the draw. They'll look to set up. Gets a piece of it with the glove. Play blown dead. Let's get the call. The Penguins are going to be shorthanded, tripping the call. A little four-on-four four hockey as both teams step inside the face-off circle. Not typically that we see four-on-four four action, although it's a lot of fun. You certainly know they practice it in practice. This is something that they're aware of. They know what they're doing. They want to possess the puck and try and create numerical advantage. And he slides it quickly to Sabaruka. Gets a glove on it to make the save. More than half the period left to play. You can feel the energy in this crowd. It's a tie game. Takes possession of the puck off the draw. Quick feed to Hall. Oh, love the defensive stick work there to poke that one away. Change up, change up. The Bruins penalty has expired. They now go to work on the power play. We know he's got a great glove hand, and man, does he ever show it off right there with that stop. Competence recognizing they're still shorthanded here as they get ready for the faceoff. And they take possession after the defensive zone faceoff. Pinned up along the boards. Nice poke check inside the attacking zone. And there's a great save by Hilbert. And they'll cover it up, forcing a stoppage in play. Puck possession so critical in today's game, and the official ready to drop the puck right here. The Penguins come up with the defensive zone draw. And the power play comes up empty. Both teams back to even strength. Poked away at center by Regula. 
along the half wall with the puck. And he slides it quickly to Sabor. And a stick in the lane ends that throw. Good positioning there to knock it away with the glove. They fight for it along the boards. Puck picked up in the open ice. Center into the middle. A great defensive heads up play to pick it off. Directed over to Coffin. I really like the way they move the puck around to wait for the right time to be able to move that puck for the one-timer in that low slot area. He didn't have much time to get it off, but he got some wood on it and buried it. Wilkes-Barre Scranton's got to be feeling confident right now with the time remaining, Cheryl. Up one with that kind of time remaining. You know you got the game in your hands, but you have to be able to close it out. You know how you do that? You find a way to get the puck, and you have to manage it. There's a chance in front! the midway mark in this period. We are all tied up in this one. And with the centers tied up, he swoops in to take possession. Works it across to Fadoon. Intercepts it in the neutral zone. McLaughlin's got it in the defensive end. Inside his own end moves the puck. The Bruins move it ahead. And they send it right back to him. Establish themselves as a playoff performer while well, the rookie an impressive start to leaving a lasting impression Well, this is just a fantastic shot knowing exactly where to put that puck low blocker side Every goaltender is gonna tell you it's one of the most difficult ones to stop The Bruins have jumped out to that critical one goal lead here at this stage of the game Cheryl Yeah, and what a stage of the game it is less than 10 minutes to play in this game You're up by one now you have to defend it, but you don't want to get too defensive because you still have to attack. There is some time left. Scores! And the rookie gets his first playoff goal! Well, it's so important to manage the expectation and the nerves when you're a rookie, and that goal is going to do nothing but give him confidence. Well, this is just a perfect screen. The goaltender can't find the puck because the screen is looking back and finding a way to take away his eyes. Does a great job, and the puck goes in. The Penguins' perseverance pays off as we are tied here in the back half of the third. Perseverance, you said it, just finding a way to get it done and stick with it. That's what they've done, and they found themselves here. They've got the equalizer now. It's a matter of now attacking and finding a way to get on top. Moves it to Coppinen. Here they come on the attack. That's blocked by Di Pietro. And they'll get a breather as the goaltender covers it up. More than half the frame has been played here. We got a tie game. And they take possession here inside the offensive zone. Providence has got the puck. Kowarowski stick handling in his own zone. 
Moves it quickly over to Samarukov. Slides the puck across to Shea. Broken up with the stick in the defensive end. Great oh, stop it! What a save on the play! And there's nothing technical about that. That is all about the will to find a way to make that save incredible, James. And as play continues, listen to these fans. They're starting to get loud and recognizing what we saw not long ago here, Cheryl. Yeah, James, I mean, they're continuing to acknowledge the save he made earlier because they know the temperature of this game. And hey, the fans are now in it. They're all on board, and guess what? The goaltender knows it. Great reach with the poke check by Regula. Di Pietro's really impressed me tonight, James. Just look at that last sequence and that desperation save. Unbelievable. I mean, when it's required to be calm and poised, he's got quiet feet, but when he needs to move and make a desperation play, he does it. Glove save! What an incredible glove save by the goaltender. I mean, he gets out to the top of the screen. He's challenging. He's saying, hey, try and beat me on this side. Carlin Bade is standing by with her answer to the head-to-head -head matchup tonight. Carlin? Hinnestroza has been buzzing, and he's been rewarded here. His name in the box score proves he's had a stronger night, guys. Here's a short pass to Hinnestroza. Good heads-up defensive play as he extends the stick. Dropped him in the open ice. Whoops, for his threaten, has got the puck inside the defensive zone. Here's a shot! Oh, what a great stop as he got a piece of it with the glove. Moves the puck. Here we go, on the rush here. And that's blocked from someone in front. Shot! Lays out to block it. Whoops, for his threaten, has got it across the line. Loses his balance on the play. Answered the call there. And the puck leaves the zone going back to center ice. Inside of the final minute here in the third. Puck battle along the boards. Good use of the body on the play. Quick pass over to Callahan. Now into the offensive zone to the right side. Moves the puck down low. Oh, aggressive move as he pokes it away. And a strong effort on that play. Oh, these are the saves when you know that your goaltender is dialed in, James. The ability to get to the top of the crease and be square to the shooter, that's a great save. And there's the horn. Regulation solves absolutely nothing. So we're going to overtime, and we'll do it next. Defensively to stop that rush. Along 
the boards. They battle for the puck back and forth. Dishes it to Toborowski. Here's a shot. Makes the glove stop. We got a whistle as the puck's frozen. A big draw looming here in the offensive zone. Wilkes-Barre Scranton's taking possession in their own end. From the left side, he moves it up ahead. And they'll battle for that loose puck along the boards. Grabbed along the boards by Saboro. Takes the feed at center and moves up ahead. Good hit on the play. Can't keep a hold of it. Wilkes-Barre Scranton's got the puck along the boards. Providence has got control of it now from their own end. They try to maintain possession inside the defensive zone. Here they come up along the wing. Takes a bump but hangs on. The Bruins will play the puck from the high net. Turns it away. And he takes the feed. Here they are on the attack. Fires it on net. Here's a shot. And it's stopped by the glove. Nice play there. A critical draw here. They take possession as he locks them up off the faceoff. A simple stop with the glove by Di Pietro. This is a face-off. They'll definitely want to win here inside the offensive zone. Wilkes-Barre Scranton's won it. Now they'll go on the attack. Quick pass to Tadoon. Stars! They take it in overtime! What an effort by this team out there tonight. The goaltender, he's going to want this one back, James. I thought that he was set to position. Just the blast of the shot, it hit him. He got a good chunk of it, but it went in. You can see the frustration in the body language. Thanks so much for joining us. We had a great time. Hope you did, too. For all of us here at EA Sports, I'm James Sabalski. Good night.